Today we are building DIY backyard roller coasters. Oh boy. On a previous budget challenge, we told you guys that we would do whatever the top comment was, and this was it. You're welcome. Here's how it works. We're driving the ball down the plinko board, and whatever budget it lands on is the budget we have to use to build our DIY roller coaster. That was a pretty good one take. We have a like for Isaac. Yeah. Curious what your roller coaster is going to look like with $75. Oh, what? Go right in between pretty good budgets. <sighs> That's really bad. It's going to be cheeks. Drew, you're going to want to back up for this one. <laughs> yes! Right. Run! 50 bucks. I'm not afraid of 50 bucks. It's only $25 less than mine. And I'm going to make mine better than yours with $50. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> this is interesting. It's two, almost two low ballers and a big baller. So who has the best stinky coaster? It's almost a mini competition between you guys. <laughs> right. We could build a better roller coaster than you. I don't it's all about the brain. Remember, I'm the smart one. I don't believe that. Roller coasters! Huh? Oh my! $2,000! The oh, big baller is no, yours, no. Andrew! Finally! We're back! You better build something insane with that much. You, you better make a good roller coaster. Thank you. Thank you. I'm gonna do the best I can with this. Before we go to the store, we need to research and do lots of thinking because this is going to be a feat to say the least. Where are we gonna research? The internet. Samuel, have you hey. guys ever built a roller coaster before? No, but I've always wanted to. No, and I haven't always wanted to. But you might be interested in today helping build a roller coaster. He's about to have a baby. I can't speak for him. It's a food baby, but it's there. Yeah. So I think we can do a bunch of research, figure out tracks, and build something insane. Well, what's your budget? I got the high baller, oh. $2,000. $2,000? Could be enough to build something. Have you ever heard of a PVC roller coaster before? <laughs> I have seen those. I think you should go that route. <laughs> He's already like in the air somehow. <laughs> yeah, this is the jump. He's coming from over here. Oh, the gap. Oh, that's, really that's fire, man. Yeah. The ring of fire, actually. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. How about me and you? Form up an alliance and do that with our budget. Well, that's never been done before. We'd have $100 to build a ring of fire. <laughs> and $25 to Johnny build a cart. Like <laughs> Big announcement, August 31st on this YouTube channel, we're dropping our movie. I Am Spaceman premieres for free on this channel. We hope to see you there. After much thought, Isaac and I, for the first time, have decided to join forces on the roller coaster. Can we make this the coolest possible roller coaster with our combined forces? It needs to have elements of danger and looks cool. Yeah. Sorry, I'm just looking at your thought bubble to see like what exactly that means. Most people, when they think of roller coasters, they think of, okay, you know, a, a car that stays on a track and does loops. We gotta throw all that out the window. Do something that's never been done before. Do something that would be banned in many countries. Banned. Banned. A banned roller coaster. That's it. The elements of danger and it looks really cool. Wait, didn't you already say that? Uh. <laughs> we have a plan. There are three elements that will always and forever be banned on a roller coaster. One, a jump. Two, fire. Three, no ending. We're not gonna have an ending on a roller coaster, so we're including all three of those elements. They're already here. So, to start, we're thinking... And it was doing that in the background. Now I'm gonna look like an idiot. But it was gonna be sick, now it just looks stupid. Right here is going to be the starting platform. So we're gonna have it raised off the ground so the cart can have somewhere to start. Next, it's gonna come down, get some insane velocity, send it flying over a massive jump. And where the jump is, is where another one of our second band elements a giant ring of fire. Yes, we're including that in our roller coaster. And then, there's no end. You go as far as the road will take you. Should be easy enough. This is gonna get us banned. And yes, we're gonna do all of this. A grand total of $125. It's gonna blow your minds. 
We actually have a lot of room in our property here to build a backyard roller coaster. There's a couple ideas I could go. Could start the roller coaster outside the bathroom window and just shoot out this way. That could be interesting, utilizing the house. But also, there's so much room out here. You can go in between trees. There's some natural slopes on the train. Might want to utilize that for speed. There's a lot of ideas. PVC pipe. This might be way too big. This is going to be way too small for a roller coaster. So you got to find something in between. Isaac and I are having to be very strategic with our roller coaster cart. So we're thinking, what if we got one of these buckets and put some wheels on the bottom? Cheap, we don't have to build it. Well, we have to do some modifications, but we could even both fit here if we want. It could be one person. Well, now that you've said that, we have to. Wow. That's a lot. I mean, this is pretty durable. There's definitely a way you can bend these as well. Do you know if these are UV rated? Do you know how to bend a PVC pipe? Yeah, you're probably gonna have to heat it up. I don't know how far you're gonna be able to bend it that way. I'm building a roller coaster though. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna get a whole bunch of these PVC pipes. Whoa! Sort of fun. This is perfect for one man. Facing each other? <laughs> Someone goes backwards? I actually can't even fit in here still. Here, you get in. Now go down. I'll be like this. <laughs> oh, we're gonna die actually. Yeah, we, maybe that's not a good idea. We'll, we'll try one person and maybe two maybe persons. Two. The best roller coasters have the best colors. I think I might go with a blue, maybe a pink combo. This might look cool. And we'll be a potty. So we'll get a whole bunch of cans of these. Should be good to go to paint all that stuff. Wheels. I don't know if these wheels are gonna hold us. Yeah, they will. Well, we don't want wobbly wheels like this, right? We want straight wheels that don't yes. go anywhere. So. These are straight, no turn. They seem kind of small to me. I'm well, afraid they're gonna. We're gonna get four wheels, and then when we get home, we're gonna have to do some trial and errors. You want a proper roller coaster, you need to try, see what fails, fix the fail. Justin, we probably need helmets, right? Yeah. Are these the kind of helmets we want? These aren't crash helmets. Yeah, but they look so easy. Hopefully, nothing falls on our head while we're doing this. That's what these are for. <laughs> yeah, but. Oh, uh, yeah. Front. What are you doing? Yeah. Try this. <laughs> Got some wood? What are you doing here? You're using my fingerboard. Brand new design, jshoeshop.com, by the way. You on there? Yeah, you got one and you got one. I got one? You got a design, you got a design. You can get my character if you want. Or my character if you want to be steezy. Or my character if you want to be the coolest kid. <laughs> oh! We have another component we're adding to the end of our roller coaster, and that is a pool. Danger. Huh? We got danger, got, it looks really good, and now we're gonna get wet. What more can If we, we can make it to the end. Oh yeah, true. We might face my into the wood. Let's buy it. I've been chafing this bad since middle school. We're back from the store, build mode activated, and we're finding wood around the content property, like these giant beams. So we're gonna utilize some wood. We need every piece of scrap we can get. This is the high baller wood. Really? This is all the stuff Andrew bought. Andrew, can we borrow so some? Stealing? Guys, I just put on some chamois, which actually is making the chafing worse and burning more. All right, so while they're building out here, I'm actually gonna build a little test track in here to make sure everything is working properly. So here's the thing. Here's a normal two by four and the PVC pipe. I could try to screw them in like this. And that might work, but I think there's a better way to do it. Whoa, look at that. Okay, I'm gonna make a few of these, a little track, see how it looks, and uh, that might be our base plate for the roller coaster. Because Jacob just liked the video, you guys just unlocked a bonus scene. Turn this pole into a gigantic lightsaber blaster. <laughs> Found bigger screws. That's gonna be cool. No way. Yeah. This thing is pretty sweet. Look at our progress. We're making good progress. Andrew only just got one track done. We're gonna be done way before the site, boy. Look at this. Oh, you built a ladder. Wait. No, it's not a ladder. Have you seen those guys <laughs> that climb the ladder and it's like, you know what I'm talking about? No. They like climb the ladder and they balance at the top. Watch this. Okay, go for it. Break it. Are you really climbing it? It's a little wobbly. It's because it's not a ladder. I don't want to do that anymore. Back to building. Don't let Andrew distract us. 
So obviously this is our starting platform. We're gonna wall off the sides. This needs to be insanely sturdy. If we're gonna be up here, we don't need to get on it and then it just collapses. We could fall off, hit head. It feels pretty sturdy. Hop up up there. Very That's sturdy so far. And then you put a wall on the side, it'll be even more sturdy. Oh yeah. Who said we couldn't build? Yeah, who said that? Also guys, we want to introduce you to the newest J Stew builder, Rick, who's going to be helping us with the roller coaster. Have you ever built one before? No way. No. I we'll figure it out. That is nice. This is going to stand out. Oh no. For future. This was just the test track. Paint and then assemble. That way there's no spillage. All right, we have our little ramp frame built. We didn't want to build it too big because we want to guarantee that we're going to get some sweet air. Also here we have the frame for the landing pad. As you can see, it's kind of a funnel shape, which was Rick's great idea because if we try to shoot off this and land on something the same size, we might miss. And even just an inch of a miss, we'd we don't want to do that. And surprisingly, 32 degree angle jumps have more force on the cart, allowing it to clear uh, about a foot gap. So the mathematics behind it do make sense. Put this bad boy on here. It's so satisfying when we cut these and they're the perfect size. Reese, get back to your big coaster. Voila! This is the vision. Definitely stands out, I think. So if I was just gonna make a basic track that just goes straight for, I don't know, 50 feet, this wouldn't be too hard, but I wanna make it excellent. I wanna make it have ups and downs and maybe a curve, not sure yet, but I also wanna make it a pretty long track. So there's absolutely no way I can do this by myself. It'll take months. Luckily, the build team, they're gonna help me out and we're gonna bring this vision to life. Hmm, you guys have some paint on you. There you go. We probably need to cut this, actually. Reese keeps stealing all of our wood back that we stole from Andrew. Yep. That's gonna hold us on there? Yes, it's not supposed to hold us on it. Because again, we put the basket in, we're gonna put wheels on the side of the cart. So when we're going, the wheels are pushing up against the side. And you have wheels underneath, so it's getting scary. That's one of the things we, we needed is we needed some danger and it's gonna look really good. Before we go any further, we need to do a weight test. Isaac, walk up the ramp. Oh. Oh my. Go a little higher. I, I, that's the middle. It doesn't matter. You need to go the whole way. That looks to be fine. No, we definitely need supports on that. Why? What are you, are you if kidding? If you get extra bounce. You said we're making this roller coaster dangerous. <laughs> it is. There's going to be fire and a ramp at the end. <laughs> <laughs> Got to make sure we get to that part even. Five. Five supports. Oh. This is going to be so insane. I can't wait to test it. This is the starting platform. It goes out like this. And yahoo-hoo-hoo-wee. And all the way down that way. I think this is going to be one of, if not, the best roller coaster video on YouTube. And he's just already already looks so cool. Time to inflate the pool and fill it up. I think the motor's burning up. A foot pump? <coughs> Blake is so kindly helping inflate the pool. Look at the air. Aha! Time to fill it up. Uh, with water is all we need. Justin, what is this? This is fine. You want to launch off this okay, onto so a bouncy pool. pool. Put the trampoline there and then the pool further. So that Boing. You can bounce <laughs> off the No. Justin. We're fine. This is going to be way, if we hit this at like enough speed, don't, we're going to go flying into the dirt. Great. Great. We're the danger boys. That's our we're name. not the nervous brothers. <laughs> Why are you breaking our ride? This is mostly our ride, actually. <laughs> As Reese has been helping build the big roller coaster, he's been giving us very good advice. One of them was to cut the ramp here that we're landing on. That way we don't clip the ramp and flip over it. So he said, lower the ramp to ensure success. And that's what we want here, full success. The track is coming along great. It's time to test the cart. They've been working on this thing. They've welded it together. It's got skateboard wheels. This is gonna be the first test with like the actual cart to see if they can go up and over and all this stuff. No people yet, though. Oh, oh it hit the middle bar. Yeah, so that, that part needs to probably be lifted. 
But that's why we have these tests. I am building a prototype cart to see if our track actually is able to be traversed by a human being. I am concerned about the strength. I am concerned about the friction. I am concerned about- Perfect, let's try it out. <laughs> There's no way a cart with a person on it is gonna make it over that. Not even a small child. What about a large child? <laughs> No. The only good news I have so far on this cart is that I'm learning a lot. I think we'll get over every hump past the first hump. After we pass the first hump? No, we're not making it over that. But if we start from the first hump, I think we'll make it over the other three. Samuel has assembled the cart. It's ready for testing. Yeah, we're definitely gonna strap some rockets to this if it doesn't have enough speed. Yeah, Marv has courageously volunteered to be the first human to go down this roller coaster. So hats off to Marv. Leave a like for Marv in the comments, guys. Step for man, two steps for Marvin. <laughs> Oh, he looks so happy. This could be catastrophic. This might be Marv's last video, guys. All right, are we ready? Ready. Rollercoaster test number one. That was actually higher up on the rail than I thought he would go, so this is promising. Samuel's gonna give him a little extra push this time. I think we're gonna maybe get over the hump. If we get over this hump, it probably will go the whole way. Always wear protection. All right, come on, Marv. One, two, three. Oh, yeah. Let's go! Go, Marv! Yeah. Go! Yeah! Oh gosh, Marv! No, Marv! Hey, let's go. Wait, you didn't put the helmet back on. <laughs> oh shoot, that's why he died. I mean, <laughs> Oh, he lives! Yes. You had us going there for a second, Marv. This makes me really excited to get really good wheels and make super legit cart. Yeah. Because I think we're going to be able to hit some crazy speeds. And if Blake and I will support all these tracks so that they don't give under the weight, and then you'll get some real speed. <laughs> I need bow. Uh, oh. It's jutting. You know, we cut the angle wrong. That angle's in my work. Oh, Okay, this doesn't look very good. Guys, don't look at those. Will the wheel get caught in there? Blake, go back to your roller coaster. I wish Blake. I, I love Blake. You. you gotta fix that. You gotta add more support underneath because if the wheels catch, it, it's too heavy here, catches. We, you face plant, I land on top of you. You rupture, you rupture everything. Because I, <laughs> I landed on top of you. <laughs> and I'm fine, but you're hurt bad. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> what a hole! Wait, you have to <laughs> no, keep it on there. Like abandoned mine shaft, like a coal chute. That gives me inspiration for the name of our roller coaster. All right, we're doing a weighted skateboard test. This isn't the official cart. We're just seeing how much speed something can get. This is Justin's body, and this is my body. Oh gosh! I guess we'll get plenty of speed. You can try that. Yes. Let's hope this works. It works. This is cart 2.0 or 3.0? 3.0. 3.0, cart test. This thing is looking insane. Oh, Third time's a charm, Samuel, get in. We are, I would not, I, I have not gotten health insurance or life insurance yet, so that's <laughs> not okay. Three, two, one, send it. Oh! Samuel is going to do the human trials. We're ready for human trials with Samuel? Yeah, sure. He did build it, so he's putting his full trust in not only himself, but the entire build team. Nervous. Would you rather ride this or a theme park ride? Oh, gosh, a theme park ride for sure. <laughs> Man, the adrenaline spike that I'm feeling right now is off the charts. <laughs> My beautiful wife None and babies. It's gonna be fatherless soon. This is probably one of the coolest builds we've done on the channel. I'm not even in the roller coaster car and I'm already nervous. Samuel is one brave soul. Drew, you're gonna wanna stand further away from the track because if this thing comes off and starts rolling, like you could just get taken out. Trees are your friends. How confident are you in this roller coaster and Samuel's trial? <laughs> You're nervous? <laughs> this is not gonna save my life. It might save you from having ET problems. Right. You ready? <sighs> yep. Yep. It's on his head. <laughs> All right, here we go, Sam. Oh gosh, what am I doing with my life? Oh no! Oh no! no! You've done it! Wow! 
do you feel, Samuel? I feel, ah, I don't even know. That was crazy. This is gonna be a blast. <laughs> Very simple yet effective roller coaster cart. We have wheels on the bottom, as you can see. Stuff. All right, so we have the wheels on the bottom, which will be like a normal roller coaster track. And we also have these tiny wheels on the side to prevent us from falling off the track. Yeah, kind of keep us going straight. If we go a little bit like this, it'll hopefully veer us back in the direction. This cart is recommended for one people, but it can fit two happy customers. Which is a combined weight of 450 pounds. You think the track can hold that weight? It's a lot of weight. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll see about that. <laughs> it's time for our first official test with the cart and the track. We're pretty much done, but this is going to determine if we need to do any critical fixes or hopefully this works. So we're gonna fill it up with weight and stuffed animals. We have our 50 pounds in the bottom along with our riders, Spider-Man Chicken, Subway, and Mars. Now this isn't even a quarter of our weight, obviously. We wanna see if the cart even makes it over this little gap. I'm getting more and more anxious about this. The test is about to begin. <laughs> Glad we weren't in that test. Oh. <laughs> oh. Well, that's pretty bad. Our cart's broken. Well, I think it still works. I mean, at least that wasn't like your leg going through. That would have hurt. Wouldn't would we have went? Would have been. Yeah. Ho, ho, ho. Way over there. Yeah. It's because this little wheel got caught on the side corner. We didn't place it in the right spot. Why didn't we place it in the right spot? Where else would you put it? Why didn't we line this up perfectly? We're so dumb. <laughs> We're not. This is like typical Isaac and Justin construction to me. Well, what do we do now? We know what we need to fix and we, yep, we fix it. You can't afford anything else because your budget's gone, but you could flip this around. So at least you have the good end on the front again. Yeah, that's fine. I'm getting less confident about both of us being in this car. What are you even doing over side. here, Samuel? I'm just helping you out. I saw that Justin was struggling to like hold the cart and push it at the same time. And you were just lollygagging down at the bottom. So I decided to be a good citizen and come over and help since we're pretty much done with ours. This is not good. To fix our problem, we're gonna have to use scraps around the property to do so. And I think I have an idea up at the barn for something we could use. You have an idea? I do. Is it the same as the one I just said? I don't ever remember hearing you say any ideas. Anyway guys, the problem we're having is these are kind of not connected. So if this comes back a little bit, it's gonna get snagged. Same could happen on this side as well. So, me and Justin both had the great idea to put some sheet metal like this, because obviously tape doesn't work. But a sheet metal will hopefully keep these, at least if they come apart a little bit, as one solid edge. So, we gotta go find some of that. They're heavy! Oh my lantern! They might be a bit thick. Ugh. Because we, if we cut this you one... You need one on both sides, bud. We need to rip it this way too, because we don't want it sticking high. Okay, like so we need to rip it like this. Really so need that this one. Yeah, that's okay. Fine. Yeah, ah. if it's jutting up and we fly off. Yes. It'll be like a guillotine. This is the ring of fire. Just a little bending of uh, some pipe here and a uh, few holes in it to uh, let the gas come out. Let the fire begin. is danger. Wow! Oh, so dangerous. What the candles is this? There's no big errors with the ring of fire, so we'll bring that, install it to the track. Things are looking up, guys. We need to make our roller coaster look appealing. Ain't nobody wanna ride a roller coaster that looks janky and just made out of wood. So, we have our paint selection here. We're gonna pick the brightest and best colors to make ours stand out. Blue. Time to paint. My name's not Thomas. Oh, just wait till you see this ring of fire. 
Oh, that's on, but you can't see it. I definitely smell it. Oh, Reese just sat in the paint bucket. <laughs> oh, Reese, you schmucks. We have the ring of fire installed. It actually is lit right now. I know you can't see it, but we can hear it and pow, be proof. Also, we just wanted to actually prove it in case there is any doubters. There is fire coming out. It's slowly melting Spider-Man's head. There we go. Oh, yes. It's not what we had in mind, but it is the same amount of danger. This is real yes, fire. exactly. If we get stuck or if you know it falls over, we're gonna get set on fire. That's the danger we need. This lens in our skin, that'll do damage. Ouch. And this whole thing is probably super hot. So far, we've completed our goal. We have danger and it looks really good. The only thing left is just to make a successful run. Yes, we still gotta fix that a little bit. And we have a special surprise. We're gonna throw at the end. Of the racetrack. Of Wait, the track. The roller coasters are both officially done and ready for riding. We're starting with the low baller one. I am curious to see how this works. You're gonna be impressed. We've worked long and hard on this. and. We're expecting success. But first, we haven't even both gotten in the car, so we're gonna try that, right? Yeah. Wait, what's the name of our roller coaster? The safe slide. <laughs> Safety slide? Yeah. All right, you get in first. These helmets are not gonna keep us safe. Am I gonna have to be on my knees? <laughs> or, the, or are you gonna have to sit on my legs? I can't be on my knees. This is a, this is a very bad idea. It's so good. This is actually the <laughs> most- actually, Oh, this is terrifying. <laughs> this You're is, gonna land on yeah, me we and jolt, break I'm me. over your head. I'll give you a little push, okay? Okay. Oh, you can't do it. You can't do this. I mean, we could also sit. I'm not sitting on your lap. <laughs> you, no, sit between my legs. Oh, yeah, sit I between. Can. I can't. You can. <laughs> I'm still in the same position. <laughs> this is probably better for speed. I don't want speed. That feel, you want speed to get over your jail? <laughs> <Yeah>. Oh! <laughs> Whoa. Uh, uh Nope, I'm going home. Actually, I'd rather be like in this position because then I could just jump and fly. <laughs> I'm taking a personal day. I can't do this. Any I can't do this. I'm so scared. We can't not do it. We're gonna get so hurt. No, we're not. This is safety slide. <laughs> no one's ever been hurt. Safety safe. slide. <laughs> this is the safety slide coaster. We're gonna give you a tour of all the fun elements. To start, we have a platform that's six feet in the air. You need to be in the air so you can get the speed down the hill. What happens after? Follow me. After the hill, we have a launch wrap through the ring of fire, which it is on right now, so I can't, you don't want to touch it. <sighs> From the ramp, you're going to land. Where, Justin? Another down ramp, which will lead to the very end of the coaster on the trampoline slide itself, if we make it to the end. The soft landing should be good. Like, if you guys make it all the way here, you're going to land in the water, which will be dramatic and really cool looking. But then you're going to bounce and then like, just jump <laughs> like this. That's what I'm saying. Onto your faces. No, or, or we slip out backwards and I hit my scowl on the wood. You can't. You're wearing a safety helmet. If it wasn't named safety slide, I'd be really nervous for you guys. My heart's beating so fast. Guys, can I not go on it? Would you be okay with that? Still Let's go it. stand up and do a weight test. I don't want to ride with you. Please don't make me do this. Uh, I'll go by myself first. I don't want to go by myself though. I'd rather go with you than by myself. I don't. I feel like it puts me in more danger going with you. <laughs> Let me go first. All right, Isaac has volunteered to go first. Why'd I do that? No, I don't Here, want to go, go first. Down. You have to go first. If I go, you will go after. Uh, I just want to get it over with, but I kind of want to see that it works, because then if you <laughs> die, I'll be like, obviously you're not going to make me go now that he's dead. Yeah, but I'm he's not... the main guy on the channel, so if someone's going to die, it should be you. <laughs> no one's dying on our, our slide. This is by far it's the scariest thing, because it's not safe in any way. <laughs> it doesn't even look that intimidating, though, when you're just standing hey, back. Also, here. remember the first test, the weight shot out the front, because it got so... Do you want to test the card again? Do you want me to go first? Because I will. I'm going to look like a big loser. <laughs> You Fine. Set yourself up. You, you'll go after me. It's your last chance to make up your mind. I think you should do it first. Okay. I'll do it, Isaac. <laughs> uh, go, Isaac. Dude, this is crazy. You want to go first, right? Sure. Really? If you guys yeah. had a bigger budget, this would be way safer because you could have gotten a seatbelt for your like, cart. We're, I don't want a seatbelt. I want to be able to bail. Like five no, miles an hour. So if we don't come to a complete oh, stop, it'll yeah. just be like, oh. What if we? What if I overshoot the? The pool. How fast are you going? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how fast it's gonna go. I'm heavy. We haven't done a, a, a four hundred pound test. <laughs> I want you to go first, but now I know that I'm gonna look like a, such a loser. No, you're not. Yes, he is. No, he is. <laughs> they're already commenting it. They, they're already writing down there. <laughs> you're saying I have to do it even it, if you go first? You have thirty seconds to decide. You're already halfway in. I know, dude. I can't. Yeah, my brain down here. My brain is smart. It's saying, don't do this. What are you doing? Get down off this ramp. Please. But my it's heart is fine. telling me I have to. There you go. Follow your heart. Let me just sit in it first. Let me just see how safe I am. You don't like it. This is so scary. 
<laughs> and I'm not forcing you to do this, right? Right. See, he's doing this at his own will. <laughs> Set me down. Yeah, well, well, I'll bring it to the edge and do a countdown. What do I hold? Do I, do I hold anything? Oh gosh. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> That's exactly what I thought would happen. Oh. That metal bar, that was, I wouldn't have thought that would be the most painful part. I said. That is exactly oh. what I said. I knew the trampoline was the worst. Now yeah, you can go. Yeah. You're editing this video, right, Rick? Yeah. I thought some of my fear made me look more brave. Oh, yeah. I got yeah. You. yeah. I was not scared at all. Yeah, you weren't. And it, and it probably looks way more lame on film than it did in real life. Totally. I'm glad I did it though. That's all that matters. <laughs> I was scared and I did it. Okay, ready? Test number two. You count me down. Three, two, one. Go. Oh, God. <laughs> Stuck the landing. That was epic. Oh. Why is that so scary? Yeah. You, know, you know what that means. Two player? Two player. Two player. Two player. Two player. We're going to have so much more speed. I think we got to push the trampoline back a little bit. It broke my hip. I'm going to break you on this one. Oh, yeah. I'm going to jump away before. I'm pulling you. You're not going to be able to get out. I'm going to have you wedged in there. This is it. This is the max test let's just, let's of the safety code. Safety slide. I have to be right here. I think we're too wide now. You can only see me. Get <laughs> <laughs> your elbows out. Here, we all put it gonna. We're not going to get past the tall bit. <laughs> What are you going to do at the end? I'm going to get out of here. You just <laughs> crack the side. <laughs> Maybe I should also kneel again. Would you rather do that? Maybe. Stand up with <laughs> Oh, gosh. Yeah, I don't, I don't like that I can't, like, move at all. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'll probably just sit down. Because this, I might fall off the edge. Maybe you should just face me. No! I'm not going down backwards! <laughs> the two-player test. Here we go. Oh, gosh. Your Three, arms and legs inside the vehicle two, at all times. One. Oh, God. Oh, no, this is not good. This is bad. This is bad. No, I'm not. <laughs> 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 Why are we still going? It's not true. Oh, the fire, the fire. What happened? You guys broke the ramp. Oh. Okay. <laughs> no more tests. <laughs> Whoa, I thought we max compressed the wood. <laughs> oh, they broke the thing. front of it too. Yeah, they broke a lot. We hit this and still cleared the ramp? <laughs> no, you yeah. scooted you the ramp like, closer. Yeah, Wait, what? <laughs> what? Oh, wow. He pulled it off. Oh, what? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. That's insane. We pulled that. That's not good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, oh. the ramp is decommissioned. No more tests. We did it though. A success. Look at that. <laughs> but now the moment you've all been waiting for, it's time to see the Big Baller Roller Coaster. It is time for the Mega Coaster. Whoa. What have you done? I didn't do too much. First of all, shout out the build team. They're all right here. What have you guys done? I was designed and built a roller coaster. Guys, if you haven't already left a like yet, wait. If you haven't already left a like, do it right now because this is their first time building a roller coaster. They learned it from scratch, bought a book on how to build it. Oh, two books. It's insane. It's mind blowing. Oh. It actually works. Fun fact, Samuel put X's on these ones and it's like, we need to replace these supports. And here they are. So we're going to do the coaster. <laughs> these are the evolution of different carts. We have cart 1.0 right here. This was the first cart ever made for this track and it broke. Now, moving on to cart number two. This was the second cart made for the track and it also broke. Cart 3.0 has been victorious so far. So I'm going to go down the coaster. How are you feeling? Nervous. Should we check heart rate? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not doing great either. 112? Oh, yeah, in the world? Geez. Reese is nervous. Yeah, I'm not doing much better. So 114, 150. Oh! Oh, <laughs> oh gosh. I'm gonna pass out, I think. 104. We're all above 100. What's happening? Down. I just want like a casual lift off. Now, what I heard is that you want extra speed. No, please, no. <laughs> please. Is this what you envisioned when you got the big baller roller coaster? I mean, honestly, something kind of like this. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't envision this at all. 
Oh. I want to be tracking your heart rate while you're on it. No. 150. <laughs> no, 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 stop. <laughs> Fire, dude. No, it's yeah. not. I'm you're scared. Gonna... This has got to be the most exhilarating thing we've done on the channel. More crazy than the overnight on the dangerous lighthouse. Yeah, can we go back there, please? Crazier than the submarine we took to the ocean. I want to be in the submarine again. <laughs> Wait, you ready? Oh. Yep, ready. I hate this. Three. I hate this. No. Two. I can't. You no. got it, Andrew. One. I cannot. Oh, freak. Go. No. Oh. 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 That was insane! Dude, those drops are scary! How do we build this in our backyard? Drops are serious. You like whip down is crazy. I was worried about like whiplash, but you really don't get whiplash. It's more just like feel like you're gonna fly out of the seat. After our initial test with Marv, we realized that without a headrest, people would die on this mm. because of the whiplash. So we made sure we got a seat with a headrest. Justin, you gotta try it. Oh, why? Because you just gotta experience it. The backyard coaster. Is anyone else gonna try it? I would, but Samuel said I'm not allowed. You would. I would. Same as I'm not allowed. Sorry. Are you? <laughs> it's okay. I'm not actually yeah. very sad. <laughs> the older I get, the more not into theme park rides I get. This is scary, Andrew. You're right. Yeah, but ever since you were a kid, you always wanted a theme park in your backyard, right? Yeah, I always wanted that, but realized maybe I actually don't want it. <laughs> <laughs> You're saying this off camera. It's like basically a once in a lifetime opportunity. Whenever again. <laughs> Am I going to go on a homemade roller coaster in the backyard? Exactly. Never. Drew, we're ready. Here I go. Isaac, ready? Here okay. you go. Enjoy your ride. Oh, Justin. Yeah, boys. Send it. Go ahead. Oh. Send it. Oh, my God. Do that again, dude. Yeah. That was unbelievable how fun that was. For being a backyard roller coaster, like this is up there with the thrill of a theme park ride. Every, everybody has to do this. This is this is, like, this is in our backyard. I don't think I've seen a roller a YouTube roller coaster as cool as this one. Nope. Hopefully we now have the coolest roller coaster. We have the best painted for sure. How did you do that? How did you build this? It's like so scary at the top, but once you do it and see how fun it is, you're yeah. like, oh yeah. I'm not long, I'm no longer scared anymore. The more I rode mine, the more scared I got. <laughs> We invited a bunch of fans from J Stu Country to come check out the roller coaster. We're going to either send Andrew and I down the roller coaster, but it's going to be determined by rock, paper, scissors. So the winner or loser? The winner goes down. Okay. You! Yes! Five, four, three, two, one, go! Let us know if you want to see us build an even bigger backyard coaster. Leave a like. See you next time. <laughs>